What is going on everyone? I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. My name is Robert Ritchie. Thank you guys for tuning into the channel. Um, if you guys can please like this video and hit that subscribe button if you're new. I greatly appreciate it. Love you guys' support. Um, so you, last video I made yesterday, I was feeding and did an update on my uh, male yellow anaconda. So today I figured I would do the female yellow anaconda and uh, show you guys how big she is she's um i wouldn't say she's a giant snake yet but she's a lot bigger than the uh, male you saw uh last video so i'm gonna go ahead show you guys her do a quick update then i'm gonna do a live feeding um so there will be a live feeding in, in this video so you guys do not want to see that you guys can click off the video plus i'll be giving a warning right before the live feeding starts so if you guys want to watch the update but you don't want to see the live feeding you can click off right when the live feeding is about to happen so there'll be a warning right when the live feeding is about to happen so you guys can be aware so anyways i'm gonna jump right into the video and show you guys this beautiful looking female yellow anaconda so this is my female yellow anaconda you can see she's a lot thicker and longer than the male i would say she's probably pushing um i mean she's probably a little bit over five feet um She's a beautiful anaconda. Look at that. So that's how they hunt. They'll stick their eyes out of the water, usually being in murky water so you can't see the rest of the body, and they blend in quite well. But, yep, beautiful looking snake. I bred her this year because she's about five years old now. Woohoo! What are you doing? But she's about five years old now, so I bred her for the first time. And uh, I'm not sure if she took or not. I'm still waiting. Um, I'm going to go with the prediction that she did not take this time. But still hoping. Um, sometimes I've had females who don't look pregnant at all, but they'll still drop. So that would be pretty cool. Yep, I'm gonna go ahead and throw her the rat and so you guys can see her life feeding. This will be your warning for the life feeding coming up right now. All right guys. I'm grabbing the rat right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and place him in. phone and knocked into the water Woo! thank god my phone is water resistant <laughs> sorry i missed that start guys but she she got my uh phone and it went into the water so that uh that str initial strike by my phone <laughs> She got my phone and said, but you can see she's already working on that rat and uh, she's getting all underwater. And like I said last uh, video, I don't normally feed my anacondas in water. Um, I do it like once every two or three months. Um, I feel like this is like something that they would, they eat a lot in the wild um, from the water. So, um, so let them do it. Plus I think it's a good source of hydration because that rat is soaked in water. Um, as you can see, she's working on that rat right now, and uh, she is a beautiful looking snake. Uh, thankfully, my phone was uh, water resistant. Um, I'm not sure if it's water resistant or waterproof, but uh, yeah, it's all fine now, so pretty happy about that. <laughs> but, um, yep, working on that rat, and we'll come back a little bit later, check more on the progress on this girl. 
All right, guys, so she's actually making really good progress on this rat, not like uh, what the male did yesterday, but she's like halfway done already. She's moving fast. And you can just see her body expanding right there. Yeah, beautiful looking snake. Look at that. That is an anaconda right there. And they, like I said in yesterday's video as well, they eat really big meals. So um, she can probably do like a small rabbit or something. Um, but right now we're just sticking with the rats. I'm actually really surprised she actually bit my phone because usually the uh, the male is a lot more um, bitey than the female is. So that actually surprised me a lot that she did it because she normally rarely ever bites. Um, it could have just been like a feeding response. You can see she like pretty much already got down. She's working on the tail right now. Slurped that all down right now. Look at the pattern on the belly, dude. She's gonna come up for air in a little bit. Hopefully she doesn't take my phone down with her again. But yep, beautiful looking snake. She's all done, eating great. And uh, yep. All right, that is all there for that video. Let me, let me know if you guys like that video. Um, if you guys uh, can, please like, please comment, please subscribe if you're new, and uh, yeah. Um, if you guys want to see more feeding videos, let me know, and uh, yep, love you guys' support. I'll see you guys next time in another video. Take care, everyone.